Welcome. Thank you so much for joining me here today. My name is Heather Lloyd Martin. I am the CEO of SuccessWorks SEO Copywriting. Today's reader question might be one that you've been wondering about yourself, which is how do I write online copy for Google's Panda update? Uh, Google's Panda update has been in the news for quite a while because it affected a number of, of sites and the site owners might have had pages that positioned pretty well before Panda and these pages have dropped dramatically in rankings so they're scrambling trying to figure out what to do. So I put together some tips about how, how to work with Google's Panda update and the first one is don't try to trick the panda. I've been seeing articles online that talk about all these special techniques you can use to get around panda and somehow fool Google into where you have more quality content than you really do. Don't do it. You know, what panda was focusing on is it, it Google wants sites that have good content to be up in the top of the search results, not really icky thin content that doesn't really educate or say anything to the reader. So what this provides the opportunity for is for you to go back and focus on those best practices. Instead of trying to trick the panda or get around the algorithm, do what everyone was supposed to be doing in the first place. Write really good content that is, resonates with your readers and gives them what they want. The second thing is to focus on quality of content, not quantity. One of the issues pre-Panda is that site owners were trying to crank out as much content as they possibly could. So rather than focusing on the quality of that content, instead it was more like we need you to create 20 articles all written around one keyword. They don't need to be good. You just need to write them fast and upload them even faster. So if you feel like you've been writing content at a breakneck speed, pace and the content hasn't been all that good, this gives you an opportunity to relax and look at your writing and figure out how to make that writing better. So rather than focus on how many articles you can kick out every day or every week or every month, focus on how can you make those articles really good for your readers? What can you do to write those, those blog posts or web pages that will be content that is shared and content that is really useful and informative? And if you focus you're writing towards what your readers want rather than what you think Google wants, then that's going to help improve your copy immediately. And the third thing is to feed the panda healthy and not junk content. Uh, what Panda did is it focused on sites that provided what, what Google called thin content. We've all seen those, those pages where you might have a page that positioned well in the search results, but when you click through, the writing was horrible. It was full of ads. You could tell that whoever wrote it wrote it just for search engines and for, for humans aren't, wouldn't be getting much use out of that article. So as we talked about you focusing on quality, you, you want to look at what is a good reader experience, what is something that will be passed by Panda and considered good, good Google juice rather than something that Panda is going to munch away immediately and kick out of the index. So focus on good, high quality content and if you have that junk content on your site now, that provides you the opportunity to go through and start rewriting those pages gradually and make them really good for your readers. Focus on your customer persona. Try to figure out exactly what your readers want to be seeing in that article and create a high quality article that your readers love and also will do really well in Google. So thank you very much, everyone. If you want even more SEO copywriting goodness, you can sign up for my weekly newsletter, and that gets you 30% off the online SEO copywriting certification training that was just endorsed by seopros.org. And if you have any other questions, here's how to reach me. Thank you very much, everyone, and have a great day.